What is a club in any case? Not the buildings or the directors or the people who are paid to represent it. It's not the television contracts, get out clauses, marketing departments or executive boxes. It's the noise, the passion, the feeling of belonging, the pride in your city. It's a small boy clambering up stadium steps for the very first time, gripping his father's hands, gawping at that hallowed stretch of turf beneath him, and without being able to do anything about it, falling in love. Those were the words of Sir Bobby Robson, which remain forever. Today, myself, Mark and Rob are talking passionately about why we want to raise money for the Sir Bobby Robson Foundation. We've got two games coming up against the African Geordie and Borough Fan TV. Please donate. Well, something that I think we all need to do, what this great man did for the club, and then when he's went through all this and had yeah, his, his troubles with cancer, his first thought was, we need to help others. Carries the name, doesn't he, Sir Bobby? You've just said it yourself. What a man, what a legend. And it's not just, you know, people talk about his football ability as a player, as a striker, and then when he went into management, the, you know, ex-players, the general public, and then his legacy went on. He wanted to help people who are suffering and families who are suffering from cancer, and his legacy goes on. Well, the Sir Bobby Robson Foundation, it marks an incredible man. Not, not only a football man, but an incredible man. Sir Bobby, everyone has a story about him. Everyone loved him so much. And it, it just seems to be the right thing to do that you know, with his associations with football, especially for Newcastle United, and the Sir Bobby Robson Foundation being local to the North East and Cumbria, it, it just feels right to raise money for the great work that they do. I think two games is, is, is great because we, last year we had uh, the one and you know we, we know what to do in terms of uh, improving and uh, organisation, that sort of thing. And yeah, we've, we've got two opponents who you know have, have choked up to the challenge, and uh, it, it, it'll be great to, to raise more money in that way for you know more people coming to watch. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can get a good crowd, and that means uh, a lot more donations. Well, far better than one. One, it gives more of a chance to raise more money because we're going to have two games going on. Gives you a chance to look at players, and also gives yeah people a chance to, to go against different opposition and also we'll get a bit of a derby. I think it's to try and get more money raised, for, foremost. For us individually, it's enjoying ourselves whilst we're doing it, uh, for a great cause. Get more people involved who who wouldn't normally be part of Newcastle Fans TV and, and part of charity looks great and uh, should have a couple of good great days. I think he was more than just a manager. He, he got the club, he got the fans, he got the city, he got everything. But like I said, he, his first thought when he had his own troubles wasn't about himself, it was, I need to do something to make sure that this doesn't happen to other people. And that was his first thought. Oh, well, I actually love Bobby Robson. He was my first, I would probably say he's my first real love as a manager. Everyone goes on about Keegan. But Bobby was for me because I was in my teens and he's told me off a couple of times, I've told this story a couple of times, please and thank yous. Uh, he's, Steve Harper's pinched me pen at a Chase Harper on the bus. Bobby Robson's on the front of the bus sitting there um, laughing and all this. So it, everybody tells a story about Bobby, but he was just a kind, kind man you'd do out for you. Oh, I absolutely love him. Um, when I began uh, getting into football when I was about five years old. Uh, Sir Bobby had just been given the Newcastle job uh, in September 1999 and that, that was the first season that, that really got me into football and to support Newcastle, my, my first love, and for Sir Bobby to do such a fantastic job uh, with the club at that time. 
yeah, it's 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 why I love the club today, and yeah, uh, such an amazing man, such a fantastic career, and you know, loved by so so many people. It is a great cause. We love the man. He did so much for this city, so much for this club. We need to do more for his foundation. Whatever it is, however little, just donate. Please donate to the Sir Bobby Robson Foundation. The work that they do for cancer patients is incredible. So please donate as much as you can. Thank you very much. Yeah, if you can donate, if you've got a couple of quid spare, payday's coming up. You know, if you've got anything left over, please donate. Small, small things can save lives.